the world I knew ended. By three, they come. By three, thy way opens. And a new one began. It started with Lilith and Inaris, the creators of Sanctuary. They each had their own twisted plans for humanity. Lilith, most of all. Salvation lies not in the light, but in you. Our only hope was a wanderer who'd been fed the demon's blood. This bond with Lilith was the key to unraveling her plans. Others joined the cause. I, Loras, was one of them. So was my old friend Donan and Nerel. I wish things had turned out differently for her. We learned that Lilith wanted more than to empower humanity. This key unlocks more than the doors of hell. It unlocks our path to the future. She aimed to devour her father, Mephisto, the Lord of Hatred. He was being reborn in hell. He's still weak, vulnerable. I must strike before he can resist. If Lilith succeeded, we'd all be damned. We had no choice but to follow her into hell. The angel Inarius and his Cathedral of Light were on the demon's trail too. An army of sheep led by a mad lion. The fool saw it as his destiny to kill Lilith. The heavens do not speak to you anymore. No! Through it all, there was another force tugging on the threads of fate. Mephisto himself. He had sent a herald to help the Wanderer hunt Lilith. Not for our benefit, but to save his own hide. Perhaps he was expecting us to join him. Your lives and those of all humanity depend on what you do next. Choose wisely. Nerel imprisoned Mephisto instead. Doing so also robbed Lilith of the power she so craved. I can't say what went through the demon's mind. Anger, yes, but was there more? Regret, sadness. With her last breath, she warned us of a dire future. Without me, you would have no victory. Nairel went off to extinguish Mephisto for good. Her heart was in the right place, but it was a terrible burden to bear alone. Lilith had been cast down, but our battle with Hell had just begun. Boy, young one, are you all right? Nerel? Oh, you're not well. Please, 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 my child, let me help you. Stay away from me! Nerel! Is that how I raised you? No, mother. But... But I must carry this burden alone. I must get to Akarat's tomb. But look at you. You're killing yourself. I... I don't know how much longer... I can... Shh. I'm here, little magpie. <laughs> I missed you. So much. I'm so proud of you. But now, I need you to give up. No, no, no! Of 
course it's you! <laughs> you monster! Let go of me! Let's go. No. You made a choice. And I warned you, little magpie. There would be consequences. Behold, the Reverend Mother Brava and the Burn Knight Yorivar, soul survivors of the battle at Hell's Gate. Today we gather to witness the dawn of a new age. One made possible by the courage and sacrifice of our father Inaris. Yuravar and I have returned from the depths of hell, bearing his message along with the scars of our trials to show that our devotion has not wavered. In hell, I was cleansed by battle and flame. Doubt and wickedness were burned away. But in the end, I was preserved. May all who serve the light do the same. This man is a mercenary, sworn to the service of the murderer, Lorath. He tried to hide the Horadrim girl, Nairel, from our judgment. A girl who threatens us all by carrying a fragment of the very same evil I battled in hell. Do you agree to repent of your sins and walk with us? In the light. I do, I do. Bless you, Reverend Mother. Thank you. In the name of the Holy Father, I swear it. Release him. With all due respect, Reverend Mother, Father Inaris's mercy was great, but did he not also preach justice? Where then was the mercy for Yosef when Lorath slaughtered him? You ever What does it say about the cathedral if we allow such sins to go unpunished? Neither Lorath or the girl have been found. We have gained nothing. So tell me, is he old? Mercy? Or is it justice? Justice! 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 No! No! No, please! I, I told you everything! I, I repented! 
Preserve him. Evil will no longer be tolerated in sanctuary, and we will show the heavens that we are worthy. Come, come, sit. I think better when I'm working. Uh, Faye, have you seen my... Uh... Ah. <laughs> this is my daughter, Fayira. We can speak freely here. Isn't that right? I understand you, word of Mayrell. Yes, our friend Lorath was on her trail. But he left off. Didn't say why or where to. I saw her, though. She came through town a few weeks ago. How did she... how did she seem? You needn't be so cautious. I know what she carries. I've seen what it has cost her. Last I saw, she went in search of passage across the river. Into Nahantu. What? You just let her go off alone? You didn't even offer to help her? What is wrong with you? Hmm. Uh, could you fetch the set chisel for me, dear? Yes, Papa. Fahira is a foundling. Of circumstance, if not neglect. She and the welfare of this town are the responsibility I have taken onto my shoulders. Just as you, Lorath, and Narel have chosen to carry the burden of creation on yours, I will not trade one for another. Would you? I suppose not. You care too much, my friend. But that is a glad thing. <laughs> Whatever you need while you're on Geokul, I will be by your side. They've returned. with darkness. You have accomplished much good in the eyes of the cathedral. I can understand why Prava has tolerated you this long. But if the church is to survive, it must hold tight to its convictions. Either the rules apply to everyone, but they do not actually exist. That builds trust. The heretic Nairel has fled holy judgment. Wielding the very soul stone she stole from our brethren as they lay dying in hell. to help you find her, Knight. How many lives will you trade to protect Nairel? Is her life worth more than his? <sighs> Oh. 
saved your life. Or Eru, if you like. Uh, Eru. Thank you. But why? Why save me? Couldn't very well leave you to fester in the river. <laughs> Bad for the fish. What brought you to Nahantu? I'm looking for my friend, Nairel. She's somewhere out there with a prisoner. A dangerous prisoner. I need to make sure she's all right. Hmm. Sounds like we should find her. Die. 
her prison. Seek Abulan, for he has strength to lend her. I couldn't get the Guardian's blessing, but we think consuming its heart will free you. In Tarsarak, you asked me if anything I do matters. I've been thinking about what I said, that with good allies, the weight of our burdens gets easier. It's me. I'm here for you. <laughs> you don't have to keep doing this alone. Uh-huh. <laughs> 
My bags are full. I had work. You did good in there. I had help. I'm Eru. But don't you saddle have to Kuras. Promise me. Oh, I cannot count on Do that here. Good deal. I'll take it. I'll find use for this. Bring me what you scavenge. I'll take a look. I've been struggling with something. Between Lilith and my veins. But you could trust me. I was our group's fist. Killing and you. I'm so you think, come on. My Lolo would always share stories of how he and my grandmother fled Kuras. The way he spoke. I'm not ready yet. This soul stone. Like every other, will eventually come to fail. So we strengthen it. I've read of a massive well of energy stored in the lost tomb of Akarat. It could empower the stone. Seven? You would not. No. Eru. What? This comes. There are tab. Fine. I'm not. Don't. Fine. For now. Need 
time to be done. Aren't you? We are pilgrims. There's the girl! Block off the exit!
you are touched by hatred. It coaxes out the bile in all things. The loathing in your heart. The bitter dead beneath your feet. Lay it all down to rest before you are consumed. To the crevasse that hit southwest. That's our. I need more time. Ready yet. I need more time. I need time to do that. Thank <laughs> you. 
time to be done. Sized hole to reach the other side. I'll crawl through. Don't make that face. I didn't mean it seriously. <laughs> that mentions Akarat too. I need more time. Yes, his final hopefully arrow Omaka.
Where's Egg? You shouldn't. Did you find those tablets? Yes. They led to a trove of information. The tomb lies near a place called the Samuk. Well done, Nero. Found it to the town, far southwest of here. Arrows from there. You know where to get us. Time to do that. Find your work, Mira. And her mistake is past. To be our present, hear and read. We choose you. Hold on to us when you feel yourself sleeping. All right? I need more time.
Thanks to you. Hey, we're even now. You can't. Can. into hell because of a poem scribbled out by a half-breed abomination. Then you escort that girl to our destruction and call it righteous. And you think I am the one who is mad? offered the people order. I offered them salvation. I offered them a light against the darkness. What do you offer? The girl killed one of the only people trying to be her friend. Don't blame me. Blame the stone. Maka, you damn fool. Why didn't you run? Uh, Ero, you know better than that. This is not to help was needed. So help was offered. Is who we are, Maka. Agarat sent me to you. I stayed when you told me of Lilith. I stayed when you spoke with Mephisto. But this, I can't stay anymore. 
I cannot ask too much of me. The price of your friendship is too high. Go. Take the child with you and go. Those words you said in the old tongue, they weren't meant for one mouth. I'll start. Then you both come in. Long Kike! Ban Lucha! Ban Kik Sene Wekoho! dreamed of this moment for so long. At last, my mind is quiet. My own. This place will be a far better warden for that stone than I. Thank you for helping her, Ariel. Don't. Forgive me.
Ever? You deserved better from me. I've done my part. See that you do yours. Is not the end I wanted for us. Enough! Damn your games and your lies! Such sweet hatred. One moment of betrayal, and my blood sings in you. Few mortals are so worthy of their birthright. Come, child of my child. I will give you the violence you long for. more for me than I could ever imagine. I promise I won't forget. I promise I won't give up. You don't need to look after me anymore. It's time for you to go. When death first came for me, the embrace of the spirit realm awaited. But now, now, I am afraid. <gasps> Mephisto's voice has been silenced, but hatred, like fear, persists. Remember this in the days to come, that in the end, Akarat was afraid. Akarat, wait! Will I ever see you again? Yes, Snake Rab. You will. <laughs> there will be time enough for that, my friend. We aren't friends. You've made that more than clear. What did he give you to betray us, Eru? Was it worth it? Mephisto has sworn to spare all that I love from what is to come. Even knowing I will never see it, I would not unmake my choices. You can't trust Mephisto to keep his promises. He will break this deal the first chance he gets. It isn't too late. Just tell us what you did with the stone and the body. We can still make this right. I have not come here to make this right. There is no making this right. There is only what you are owed. A reckoning. Today, I have chosen to break your trust. And every day I live, I must choose to do it again. And I say to you that I am not that strong. Enough of this. Stop making excuses. Here is what you want, then. Here is your vengeance. Come! And take it! Oh, Eru. He 
picked a fight he knew he wouldn't win. Bringing Mephisto into the vault nearly killed him. And when it didn't, he asked us to finish him. To end his pain. You're sure this is the right move? Letting him go? I... know how it feels. To carry the guilt of hurting someone. And I know too well what it's like to wrestle with the Lord of Hatred. Eru made the only choice he thought he could. It's infuriating. It's crushing. But he's already done the worst he can do to us. Let him wrestle with himself now. It's what Akarat would want. If we kill him, we rob him of the choice to be better. It's time we return to the Horodric Vault. It might have something, anything, that could help us against Mephisto. We are all villains in someone else's story. The Haradrim know this better than anyone. We've all made hard choices to protect what we love. Choices that seem necessary, even righteous, in the moment. But the Lord of Hatred excels at turning the blade of righteousness back into our guts just to hear us scream. The choices we made in Hell had aftershocks we are only now beginning to understand. How would history paint us for the path we'd taken? How would it paint Eru? Eru made his choice out of love and despair. I can hate him and still understand why he did it. And how it made him the devil's perfect tool. Another twist to the blade of righteousness. Perhaps Eru believed it was all worth it. The Hansu and the Spirit Realm were spared from Mephisto's touch. But that only meant they were cursed to watch the rest of the world wither. In the age of hatred to come.